Okay, well, might as well just keep yeah. setting this up. Yo! Whoa, whoa. What the Yo. F What was that? What the? Is that someone screaming? Over where that noise went? What is up guys, welcome back to the Hypest channel on the internet. It is currently six in the morning and we are about to make a large hike inside of the Wendigo forest. But this isn't the same forest that we adventured in one year ago. This is a completely different forest, locally known as the Whispering Pines. And recently, a lot of weird stuff has been going down, like half a search and rescue team disappearing in the woods with no explanation why. But some of the residents here are saying that it is due to the Wendigo and I have a feeling that this is true. This has caused the police department to completely restrict this area for public access. So we literally had to sneak past security just to get here. As you can hear behind me, there is literally a police chopper exploring the area, but hopefully they don't see me with this massive light right here. We're still kind of close to the road. So we got a little bit of a hike to get back into the woods without anybody seeing us. So before the sun comes up, we're gonna try to get some distance in to try to get deeper in the woods to find a place to set up camp because the weather is calling for a blizzard tonight and we don't want to be snowed in before that happens. If you guys are excited to see what the Wendigo Forest has in store for us, make sure to go down below, subscribe to the channel because this is the type of crazy content that I do all the time. And I also like to mention that we are almost at 2 million subscribers. Guys, that is absolutely insane. I want to thank each and every one of you who have gone down below and clicked that button and showed me any kind of support. Your love means the world to me. You've changed my life for the rest of its trajectory and I appreciate it so, so much. I'm like getting emotional over talking about it. Doing this is the best job in the world. I know I put myself in crazy situations, but all of it is worth it because I know you guys love it so much and all I wanna do is produce more content just like this. So if you're not a subscriber, you need to go down below because we've been on some crazy, crazy adventures. So we wanna get going, we wanna get deep in those woods and try to find a place to set up camp and see if we can last the night. If you guys think we can do it, leave a comment down below of what you think. But I have a feeling today is gonna to be absolutely crazy. Oh crap, oh crap. Oh just go, just go. Once again, thank you so much for almost getting us to 2 million subscribers. Now let's go inside and see what the Wendigo Forest has in store for us again. Yo, whoa, whoa. what the Yo. f What was that? What? So recently I had a fan on Instagram send me a link to an article okay. on a website that was kind of sketchy, but I took the risk, checked it out, and it led me down a rabbit hole of a series of articles this person has written on their website that is alluding to something possibly related to the Wendigo Forest. Dude. And I know we've done it before, but these were very interesting articles and I would love to get your thoughts on it. Dude, why can't we just go to somewhere nice? Like a beach in, you know, Cancun, Punta Cana, maybe uh, Mexico, anywhere. There's plenty of time for that, but this is a very recent story. It's going on right now as we speak uh, and it's, I don't know how long this Wendigo is gonna be in the area. So I think right now it's prime time Wendigo season. We're in the winter. Things are getting really, really cold. If we want to capture the Wendigo again, this might be our solution. <sighs> okay, let's read it. All right, so the first article reads, eerie disappearance, new missing persons case baffles investigators in local forest. Okay. So Whoa. this is the first of many. Dude, Whispering Pines disappearance remains unsolved. Whispering Pines. Whispering Pines is kind of like the name they're giving to the woods. Hmm. I don't think that's the official name, but that's like kind of what the locals yes. are, uh, are alluding to. So the search Strange. team returns empty handed from Whispering Pines. Hmm. Hawthorne Country Sheriff Department is once again seeking the public's assistance as another individual has vanished within the forest known locally as Whispering Pines. 
<laughs> this disappearance marks the fourth such case in the past three months leaving investigators and the community increasingly concerned. The latest missing person, Sarah Wilson, was last seen entering the forest on a popular hiking trail on December 5th. An extensive search was launched involving both local law enforcement and volunteer search and rescue teams. Despite their efforts, no trace of Wilson has been found. So the sheriff says, we are committed to utilizing all available resources to locate Sarah Wilson and return her safely to her family. Routine searches of the area are continuing. Dude, that's nearly two months ago too. Yeah. Like that's, so, a lot, that's crazy. A lot has been going on in the woods. And they said for the past three months, a lot of other cases just like this one have been popping up. Yeah. While the forest is frequented by hikers and nature enthusiasts, the recent events have cast a shadow over their reputation. The sheriff's department urges anyone with information regarding the missing persons to contact their office immediately. Dude, that's crazy. Yeah. So. Jeez. And there. Oh man. And there's multiple reports of this. And then this the last. Is, this is the first one, and this is like the best case scenario. Only what? one person has gone missing. Wait until you read what comes up next. The second article is um, this one right here. So it Shadow reads, in the woods. Whispering Pines mystery deepens as search yields terrifying results. Jesus. And I think I'll have you read this one because it kind of blew my mind. More than half a search and rescue have yet to return home after their search ends in disaster. What? The string of disappearances in the Whispering Pines has taken a chilling turn. A recent search and rescue operation descended in chaos when half of the experienced team vanished without a trace within the forest. Officials are scrambling to explain the unprecedented incident whilst the community grapples with fear and a growing sense of helplessness. No wonder. That's not surprising yeah, at all. Half a team. Despite an extensive multi-day effort, no signs of the missing search team members has been found. The operation was marred by a explain, unexplained equipment failure, including a complete radio blackout that severed communication with those who ventured deeper into the woods. How is that possible? Yeah, I don't, I don't know how that makes any sense. Mechanical fail, electricity, like how yeah, is that possible? Yeah, that's what they're saying. This is a devastating development. We are utilizing every resource available to locate our missing colleagues. Their extensive experiences gives us hope that they may be found. The sheriff's words offer little solace to the families of the lost team members, naturally. It's a nightmare. They keep saying everything is under control, but how can they possibly know that? My husband is out there somewhere, said Sarah Collins whose husband was amongst those who vanished. So yeah, there's literally like a bunch of families who have no idea what's going on, and all they're saying is, yeah, we just lost contact with them. And Dude. Like half and, of them just and, gone. And, and I, I'm, I just don't understand how the Wendigo kind of fits into this, but I guess... Yeah, we'll get into the Wendigo in the next article, but yeah. One question echoes through the county. What truly lurks within the shadows of the forest? So even the journalist is questioning, like, there's something, like, Dude, actually going on that isn't being said by the sheriff. That is bad, bro. That is bad. Last article, one of the worst. Mounting mystery, Whispering Pines investigation abandoned. Officials issued dire warning. They gave up? Yeah, they just literally gave up. Jesus. Whispering Pines, once a hiker paradise, now unsafe and closed indefinitely. They couldn't figure it out. Look at that. It's yeah, like barred scene. out? Dude, that's terrifying. Can't even go inside, so. they, how do you bar out an entire forest? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. It's They needed a long piece of tape to like cover Yeah, the whole thing. Hundreds yeah. and hundreds of feet. <laughs> the investigation into the Whispering Pines disappearances has ground to a demoralizing halt. Search efforts have officially been suspended and a heavy police presence now surrounds the forest. The Sheriff's Department has issued a stock warning. Whispering Pines is closed indefinitely and entering the area is strictly prohibited. This decision was not made lightly, stated the Sheriff. However, the safety to the public is our paramount concern. The events in the Whispering Pines defy conventional explanation. We urge everyone to respect the closure and avoid the area from their own well-being. Dude. Yeah, Harris's words offer no answers, only escalation of the mystery and the growing sense of unknown threats lurking within the forest. The sole survivors of the missing search team remain hospitalized. There's one? Yeah. And their mental state deeply fractured. They speak only in disjointed whispers of a monstrous creature, an impossible predator stalking the woods. What the hell? Dude. Is this his quote? Yeah. The, the skull, it, it is always hunting. What does that mean? What does that mean, dude? What does that mean? Dude, that's creepy. And then the last part, there's a 
local that says they're hiding something claims Thomas Evans. That's probably why they closed it down. Yeah. My family always lived near those woods. We heard stories, old tales of a Wendigo spirit. Maybe those stories were true. Bro. Yeah. That's crazy. I read that part and I'm like, damn, like this is... This is real. Yeah, and it's saying the per the survivor, the skull, it's always hunting. Dude. And then it's saying that a monstrous creature, an impossible predator stalking the woods. Dude. That's gotta be, there's gotta be some It's gotta value. be something, yeah, that's gotta be something. But I guess my question is like, if they're blocking off the whole forest, how do you plan on getting in? That's my, that's what I'm thinking. Like, how do you block off a whole forest, you know? There's gotta like, be some Maybe there's like a road closure that we could like sneak by. I'm not exactly sure, but. Can't be too hard. I'm thinking we go to this town, Ask around, try to find the woods. Oh. And if we could find this place, we go inside and see if the Wendigo is still haunting people to this day. Oh, you in? <sighs> yeah, I'm in. I'm in. So, I think we made it. Yep, it's looking like this it. This is uh, the entrance, we and yeah. it is said that there's been multiple Wendigo sightings in these woods, so keep an eye out. And obviously, right away, snow is falling, yep. which is a sign the Wendigo brings blizzards. And there's like fresh snow everywhere. Yeah, so clearly something was here, that's for sure. Can you hear that? It's so nice here. And so peaceful, do, isn't do, it? Do, 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 do. What? Look. Like right away. Wait, well, they're like fresh? Not really. What do you think? Dude, remember? Last time we were hunting the Wendigo on the lake? Yeah. There was footprints on the snow. Yeah. And they looked kind of like that. Yeah, it's kind of like animal-esque. A little bit of... Yeah, like look at that. These are far. That doesn't look like a bunny. It does not. Where does it go? How is this like right away, guys? We haven't even been here. Obviously, there's no like, yeah, there's footprints. Like so some sort of animal. That's pretty much it. Yeah. What? A, that's weird. Let's I guess follow these tracks and see where we could go. Um, so the plan is right now is to find a place with flat ground that is suitable for us to set up tent. Got all the stuff up in here, set up tent. And then after that, we can start putting cameras around in the area. Yeah. Just like we did last time to capture. Whoa. Oh my God. Bro. Jesus, I almost just disappeared. You okay? <laughs> Holy. Yeah, no, for sure a good idea. A lot of trees to uh, set these trail cams on. Wow. And Look how deep that hole is. Yeah, that is strange, huh? That's what I'm saying. What if we're on like some sort of bridge or something? Oh my, wait a minute. Yeah, it's like a hole. Maybe we are on a bridge. That's kind of scary. Yeah. <laughs> There's like water we're surrounding us. We bridge. can't even see it. Jeez. I find it, even though we're in the Wendigo forest right now. Yeah. It's very pretty. It is. It's very pretty. The birds were chirping earlier. I don't know yeah. if you could have heard that. Yeah, it, it genuinely is bit. really nice. We maybe got like three, four hours of sunlight. Yeah. So yeah. we're going to take a little bit of time to make sure that the camp is absolutely perfect. Yeah. And then we can really get this hunt going. What the hell was that? Whoa. What was that? What was that? What the heck? Dude, that was loud. That bro. was loud. That came from like over there. Did that sound like a Wendigo or what did that sound like? Uh, dude, I don't know. It was like a growl. Yeah, that was weird. What the hell? Are we still going or what? I don't know about this. I think I see like some kind of like shed over there. I don't know if you could see it on the camera. It's kind I'm of having gray. a hard time. It's really far. It's like through the through there. Huh. Well, the only one way to find out. Came huh? from. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Let's head that way. There seems to be some kind of structure. We're gonna hit that, and then hopefully have some kind of idea of where our camp's gonna be. See something. Wait, Michelle, look. Dude, you hear that? Sounds like there's something nearby. But look, look in front of us. 
footprints. Two sets of footprints. Dude, these are fresh too. Yeah. Remember the Wendigo tracks? They yeah, were like yeah. covered in snow. Yeah. Huh. So there are people here. What I was trying to point out was the, the sheds right there. Yeah, that's what I saw too. Maybe I just saw that green here? like, I don't know, potentially. We can, we can go find out. Dude. I'm a little worried though. I thought we were the only crazy ones out here. <laughs> right? People are out here searching for the Wendigo as well. Not too surprising, I guess. Yeah, there's some kind of like structure here. Yeah, what is that? Huh. Weird. It's like a shed. It looks like some sort of shed with some scaffolding or a very badly put together shed. Yeah, see these footprints go up here. So yeah. they just completely passed over it. But this could be a good spot to, to put the tent. Yeah, that's true. Because there's no like snow going on. Could be like literally in there. It's still warm. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. Yeah, I think guys, we're gonna cut the camera for now. We're gonna set up camp here. And then once all the cameras are set up, we could just start relaxing and enjoy our night and hopefully capture evidence of whatever Wendigo is lurking in these woods. And we're done. Um, Michelle, are you sure you got the right tent for, for us? It looks a little small. Um, I was wondering why I had so much room in the bag, but... And like, these, like, poles are like so flimsy. Are you, I don't know about this, man. Listen, I got a lot of tents, so it's hard for me to pick the right one you for probably, every different occasion. You know, organize them. Yeah, they're all <laughs> kind of just shoved in the corner of yeah, my basement. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> well, but uh, yeah, this is little, it. It'll do. I like the... The roof here is going to really save us, you know? Yes, this is the tent that yeah, I was true, in, true. We actually could anticipating. technically sleep on the floor. Yeah, we could. It's quite warm in here. I don't know if it's because I was moving a lot, yeah, but it, it really is. Yeah. Well, you want to take a look inside? Yeah, room tour. Let's take a peek here. There's just blood everywhere. Oh my God. Oh no, please. Oops, we totally forgot to clean it up. Oh God, let me get in here. Oh, geez. Okay, you know what? It's More spaces than I thought. Ugh, normally yeah. we're four, so. Yeah, and four humans in here, two. This is comfortable. Yeah. Look how I'm sleeping. I'm fairly comfortable. <laughs> yeah. In a little Super ball. Cozy. I think we will be able to straighten out. Plus, this could stay open. Yeah. While no. we like watch the scenery. True. 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 It's darker. Yeah. So, right now it is almost 3 p.m. Yep. 12 hours until the sun comes out. Ooh. Um, so we're going to. You heard that? Yeah. That was weird. We're gonna start setting up the cameras. We're gonna go back on the trail, maybe follow those tracks, set up some cameras here and there around camp, and then on our way back, I'll be able to check on my laptop, see if there's anything on the live footage. If not, we're just gonna chill, maybe follow some noises. But so far, nothing too crazy has been going on. Yeah. The storm kind of stopped. There's no more snow. Yeah, that's... But, uh, hmm. yeah. The birds are still chirping. It's still a good vibe out here. It really is, yeah. All right, so you ready to set up some cameras? Let's do it. Okay, so let's set up our first sleeping bag. We do want to be a little bit comfortable on the ground. And warm, right? This is not that uh, warm, unfortunately. You'll get there one day. <laughs> I think it's the gloves. Yeah, it's a little bit tough. Here. Yeah, come on. Come on. <laughs> what is going on here? <laughs> okay. Wait, listen. Is it just me or is it really quiet? Dude, there were so many birds earlier. I know, and there's literally nothing. It's dead quiet. That's creepy. Yo, it's so creepy. What happened? I don't know. <laughs> Something ain't right. It was literally, we're setting up cameras and we're like laughing about it. Like, oh, like nothing's actually gonna be out here. What the heck? It's like dawn, you know? Dude. Wait. What the f is that? Sounded like that thing earlier, but like yeah. closer. Wait Dude, up. yo, is that coming towards us? It's right there. I think. Yeah. Oh. It's going somewhere over there. 
So creepy. That was so close. I thought we were like listening for like noises. 100%. So we might have missed that or it might have hurt us. Yeah, no. That is weird. Okay, well, I'm gonna just keep setting yeah. this up. Oh. Yo, oh. what the oh. f? Yo. What was that? What the? Is that someone screaming? Over where that noise went. Shit. No way. I can't see anything. Oh, was that the I don't know. What the hell was that? Like it literally ran, it was like sounded massive. Like a weird group. Yeah, it did make a really weird noise, but. And now there are people over there. Yo, bad. The footprints, too? Yeah, yeah, that's probably them. Shit. Dude, we need to go check that out. Yeah, make sure they're okay. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. That's crazy, bro. Yo. Okay. Um, you see anything? I don't see anything. Huh. That was like that way. Yeah. What the hell was that, bro? Okay, we gotta go on that trail. Should, should we take down. the trail or should we go like where the noise came from? Maybe go straight that way? I don't know. What are you thinking? Um, you got boots to go in the snow? Barely. We can make it work. Okay. Let's just go this way. Take it slow. We don't know what the hell that could have been. Yeah, yeah. But some people might need our help. Okay, let's go. Dude. Must be the person that we heard, right? Yeah, yelling. Okay, yeah, let's make our way. Hello? Jesus. Ah. Oh my god, dude, this blood. Oh god damn. Careful. Hello? Hey! Are you okay? Hey. Hey, are you okay? What the hell? What is that? What's going on? What, is what happened here? What is that? Jesus, there's blood everywhere. Hello? We're we're looking for the Wendigo. Is that is that what happened here? Yeah, I, yeah, attacked by a bear. What? What? What is a he talking bear? about? It, no way. There's a bear. That, that's what we heard, right? Are you are you okay? I mean, there's blood everywhere. Yeah, funny. Funny. Can you stand? Please. No. Come on, come on. I, we're Sweet gonna get you out of here. Hey, no, leave me here. Leave me here. Just make sure that whatever's in that cage is safe. What? The cage in the safe. Wait, where's the cage? What? Wait. The thing that's in there. There's nothing in there. Wait, 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 wasn't there just a skull in there? There was just a skull there. What the what hell? What the hell? Wait, what was going on? What are you talking about? Wait, there's no skull. What just happened? What was that? Nothing's in there. Where did it go? No, there's nothing in there. How did it move like that? Dude, what's going on? I don't know. What is that? Okay, dude, we need to figure out a way to get you out of here, bro. Yeah, do you, uh... Don't just leave me here. No. Retrieve whatever you yeah, we're not just gonna leave you here. No, bro. we're You're not. We'll die out here. Yeah. I, have a, I have a cabin. What? It has all the supplies you need. It, is it nearby? Yeah. Um, How no. Close? How close is it? Because we, we literally have a camp. Like we, we have a, we have a camp set up. It's, like it's way closer. Away. We have we have a med pack. We have bandages. We can get you out of here, bro. It's just about a mile down the road. Okay. No, no. We don't have the time for that, we dude. We don't have time. Are, are, are you gonna be okay for like the next like three minutes? I'll be fine. Okay. We gotta run back. trail. What? Oh, perfect. We were literally walking in the woods for nothing. Yeah, seriously, Jesus. Shoot. Should be right here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's coming up, right? Holy crap. Oh my god, dude, we gotta hurry up. This is not good. What the hell's going on, dude? I don't know, bro, but all I know is it's not good. Okay, let's see. We gotta get this. Oh. You said it was in the tent, right? Yeah, it should be... I don't know if it's in the tent, but it might be in my bag. Okay. Dude, that was crazy. As if, bro. Do you think the noise, like passing over here, was the bear? 100%, bro. I think that's what it was. We thought it was a Wendigo. But, dude. Now we got a freaking bear to worry about on yeah. top of the Wendigo? Oh, man. Where is it? Dude. What? I don't think I have it here. What do you mean? It's not in here? I might have left it in the car. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. Over here? No. What the hell? Oh! Dude. No. Oh no. Was that? Was that the, the guy? That might have been him. Holy sh! What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? You know what? We don't have do the med kit. We gotta go back. Yeah. What, 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 we just like both carry him. 
Yeah, you know what? Let's do that. Yeah. That's fine. You can show us where whatever cabin is and. Why is he screaming yeah. though? I don't know. F I don't like that. I don't like that either. Okay. Uh, let's just let's hurry up. Come on. <gasps> Go on. Just oh, gotta get around here. I think. Hey, we're hey. here. Where? What the? What the hell? Where did he go? Hello? Oh my God! Look at all the blood. Shit. Holy shit. Hello? Hey, dude, what happened? Oh my God! Oh no! That's not good. That is not good. What happened? Hello? What? What did he, he just get walked his, off. What was his name? I don't know. I didn't catch, catch his name. Oh God. Um. What do we do? Well, wait. He left the briefcase behind. What is that about? Here, let me. I was with them, right? Yeah. That's weird. Should we open it? I don't know. Maybe. We try. Wait, what was that? Yo. What Mich Michelle? F is that him? What, what is that? Dude. What, the what was that? Shh. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, God. He sees us. He sees us. What the hell? Yo, what is that, Jesse? I don't know, but he's walking What is that? Us. He's walking towards us. Just, just keep going, just keep going. What is he just doing that? I don't know, man. Dude. Yo, what is that? I don't, I don't know. Yo, yo, yo. Yeah. We need to get out. Okay. Just go, go. Oh my God. He still sees us, bro. Yeah, he's still coming. He's still coming. Cutting the woods? Um, yeah, I think this is a good idea. Shit, man. Ugh, dude. It's starting to get really dark. It really is. Oh, Jesus. I don't even think this is a trail. No. Is that thing still following us? God, I hope not. It's starting to freaking snow really heavy, yeah, though. We gotta find something quick. You know, something weird about that skull. Yeah. That person. That didn't look like anything like we've seen before. No. No, I don't know where he even got it from or what happened. But it, it looked like a Wendigo without fur. I don't know how yeah, to yeah, describe it. Yeah, yeah, it's definitely Because the one we saw before, yeah, like there was way more features or like- 100%. Like hair on it. Yeah, yeah. What is this? Is this our cabin? What? Cabin? Holy shit. Dude, oh my God. This doesn't look like it. No, it looks small. What is this? Oh, jeez, oh careful. Anything in there? Just a bunch of stuff. Huh. Well, it's gotta be around here, right? If this is here, then that's some sort of sign of yeah. civilization. Yeah. All our stuff is at the freaking cabin. Say. Well, if we can't find anything else, yeah, it's a good spot. Come back here. Yeah, hundred percent. And then whenever it's daytime, we could try to find all our cameras and stuff. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Okay. Oh. <clears throat> but right now we're kind of lost. Yeah. We just keep looking for now, and hopefully, the snow doesn't get that much worse. and then we can open this and see what's inside. Yep. Did you catch that? No. What was that? I just got the camera on. I don't know if I even... Dude, that was loud. Dude, I feel like we're lost, man. Like, we're not finding anything. Yeah. Maybe so, we should head back to that little cabin. Update, guys. It's been like 30 minutes. The sun has completely set. Yep. We are literally in the middle of nowhere. We actually found, like, a trail, but we're yeah. not exactly sure which direction to go in, so. Yeah. What are you feeling? 
Um, it's getting real cold, man. Oh, shoot. What? Lights. Oh, I see lights. Look, there's like paths or something like animals or... What is that? Oh my god, bro. Is that it? The soldier? Yeah. At the cage. Yeah. I mentioned the cabin. I have a, I have a cabin. What? It has all the supplies you need. Is that the cabin? Yo. No. It's only one way to find out, huh? Get there. Let's go in. Oh. Dude, that's crazy. Oh. oh man, I think it is that. Oh. I'm seeing a lot more lights, man. It's looking good. Hopefully there's someone there that can help us or like we can like tell somebody about what the hell just happened. For sure, for sure. I don't know if there's other people, but hey, I guess we're gonna find out. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Oh, Dude, man. this place is huge. Holy crap. It is. Oh, thank God. Please be warm. Thank God it stopped snowing, dude. Yeah, dude, this is crazy. Oh, we have to climb a little hill before we get up there. Is it solid? It's solid, but it might be hard to get up. I think just climbing up might be yeah. high. Oh man, it's steep. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Oh. All right. Well, that's good. Let's see if there's an entrance or something. Look for any kind of Wendigo trail. Looks pretty bare to me. Oh, oh what is this? This is where they lock him in. Oh my they god. They hold him deep. Oh god. See anything? There's a way in from the other side. Think so? Dude. But this there's a staircase right here where you just climb up. Yeah, yeah, I probably should do that. Yeah. Check it. Knocked down. Chair knocked down. That's weird. That is weird. Not a good sign. Oh. Got oh, motion wait, sensors. Light. Dude, this is weird. <laughs> Yo. Is there anybody in here? Doesn't sound like it. Hello? Look. What? Remember the med kit that I was talking about? Oh, yeah. Is this a spot, you think? I mean, there's boots everywhere. Oh. Yeah. That's gotta be it. Oh, if we ever freaking see him again. Yeah. Here, that's look around. Happened. Look, that's that, that's that chair. Let's see what's over here. There's a laptop. Yo, there's a laptop. Maybe we can contact somebody. Here, try. That's an SOS. Oh, it's Owner. Sign in. Huh. Press any key to unlock. Yeah, just. Village idiots. Village idiots? I don't really have a. I don't know. One, two, three, four. Imagine that just works. I would love that. Sorry, password. Hmm. Well, that's weird. Well, what do you think? Yeah. Well, let's maybe just look around. Yeah, we could look around. Oh. I hear something, though. What do you mean? Over here. There's water running. Oh! What the heck? Dude. So somebody's here. Or someone was here. They ran sure. out quickly, maybe? Food broke. What the heck? Okay, they were like in the midst of something and then they just scurried off or something. Are you. What are you. What are you doing? It's still warm. What are you. Okay, if it's. You're right, it is. Holy shit. That means the guy must be okay, someone, close. Maybe there's someone sleeping. Hello? We need to find like a room or something. We're lost. Hello, is anybody here? map. 
pistol clips. Hmm. Classic. Okay, that, look, is that us right here? Some sort of like cabin looking thing? Yeah, we got a cabin. And there's like a pathway. The trail leads to... Hmm. What is that, dude? What is that about? I don't know. And then here we have danger. So a zone where we probably shouldn't go? Or... This would be like this. Are you sure? You sure? What is that? It just turned off. It's just turned on. Look, the lights on. What is going on, bro? Can they hear us? I don't know. Is there, is there anyone there? Uh, yeah, we're we're at, we're at the cabin. Uh, what what's going on? Where are you? Who is this? I mean, don't say that. Delivered to the facility yet? What? Can you can you repeat that? Has the entity been delivered to the facility yet? Uh, no. We we were attacked by a bear. We got we got split up, but we're okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, we have the skull with us. Um, yeah, totally secure. Totally not outside. I'm screwing around. Get that skull to the facility at once. You know what the foundation will do to us if you fail this mission. You have the access key, right? What? Access key? What? Which one in particular? Your access card. The one you found in your briefcase? Oh, yeah, yes. yeah, yes, that yeah. one. Um, yes, we have the key card and we are delivering the skull at once. Can you just um, quickly remind me what the password to the laptop is? It's a secure server. The password should be physically attached to the unit. Standard protocol? What? Right, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, um, yeah. okay, well. It was kind of smudged, so I was uh, just wondering, you know? Wait, who is this? What's your badge number? Oh, just turn it off. Turn yeah, it turn it off. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, shit. Dude, who was that? <laughs> I don't know, but they just gave us a lot of information. Wait a minute. So what deliver the skull to the, to the facility, he said, right? Is this the facility? What is this? This is, it looks like a cabin. Hmm. That's got to be us, right? It has to be. Well, he said something about the yeah. Laptop. He says something about the laptop, right? Something about a password being attached to the physical. Yeah. Like, is it on the actual laptop itself? Look around. Oh, dude. Oh, <laughs> oh my God. Let's go. Okay, six two six M two two six. All right, that shouldn't be too hard. Six two six M two two six. Oh, it worked. That, dude. Oh, okay. now we know to do we that every time. Kind of email here. Okay. Um, Is he mission update report. Mission update. Containment phase on schedule. Subject compliance higher than projected in preliminary data. Minimal resistance encountered during transport. Hmm. All right. Second email. Minor logistics delay due to redacted. Sea field incident report attached. Subject remains stable. Request confirmation for adjusted arrival ETA at rendezvous. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Team 2 at final transport stage. SCP-323 and secured items have arrived at rendezvous point. Proceeding pre-authorized orders will transmit status confirmation upon successful handoff. SCP. SCP. That's him. Dude, that was on the soldier outside. I, I got I got I recorded it. It was on his uh, key, key card. Really? Yeah, and I think he even had a badge or something, like a patch or something that said SCP. So was he, are they talking about him, like he arrived with the secured items and arrived at the rendezvous point? Potentially, yeah. Maybe the spot right here? Maybe, yeah. And then it was, that's what their next mission was to bring it to the said, you know, drop off point. But what is he talking about? We just got an email recently. It says mission completion status. Did the handoff occur as planned? Third head base confirmed. Hmm. No, it was just Don't like, so. it was just like an hour ago. Okay, well, they know, you know, enough that it wasn't delivered, but 
What's going to happen now? I don't know what's going to happen now. <sighs> Whoever was on that, it seems like something's like ongoing. Like yeah, we're yeah. in like the middle of something. Yeah, right now. we probably even shouldn't even be here. Yeah. Especially if that thing is still out there. Well, this is the, probably the safest place we could be. Well, at least for the nighttime, I guess. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, wait till morning, and then we could easily, like, find our stuff back. Dude, yeah. those cameras, bro. Like, I don't even know if I'll be able to get the footage back. Yeah, seriously, jeez. They're just, like, out there. Yeah. Um, do you want to check the suitcase? It's time. I think yeah, it's time. Let's freaking do it. Let's do it. I'll keep this open in case there's, like, any more updates. Yeah, we'll hear, like, some sort of email or something. Okay. Well, the moment we've been waiting for. Let's see if there's anything crazy here. files okay like what is this like hidden anywhere in there what is that just a chess piece hmm. <laughs> what is that that's weird there's got to be more to it is it like a secret sort of device it's pretty light so probably not <laughs> i don't know well let's open these things up come on down Oh shit, we got some. Whoa, confidential. Are you even allowed to be reading this right SCP now? SCP Foundation. Well, we'll just pretend like we didn't. Yeah. We should probably lock the door. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna lock the door. <laughs> just in case. Confidential eyes only level four clearance mission log SCP-323 retrieval and transport. So this is what's happening, right? February 15th, it's literally like a couple of days ago. Mm. Subject description, cervid skull pending species clarification upon further analysis has been identified to possess significant anomalous properties. Primarily anomaly involves transformational capabilities upon direct human interaction. What? Designated as SCP-323, the current host entity is herbally referred to as SCP-323-1. What? Dude, this is freaking crazy. What the hell? You think this is talking about Wendigo? I don't know, bro. Because all the reports that I was like reading up on was like thing with like antlers, right? Yeah, yeah. And like, making the noises that a Wendigo make in the winter time. Like yeah, this is yeah. like prime time for Wendigo season. And like this is like something completely new that we've never even heard of. Retrieval objective. The primary mission is to secure acquisition and transportation of SCP-323 to facility Alpha-9 for in-depth analysis and containment. Given the objective's potential for significant psychological and physical impact on human suspects, its retrieval and securement has been classified as urgent. Oh, right here, it says Village Idiots. Mobile what? Task Force Epsilon-6. I don't know why they're called Village Idiots. <laughs> I don't know why they're, they're called, called that. Fine, Handling and containment of anomalous entities with transformational or mind-affecting capabilities. Is that what the skull was? I don't know. But it did, like, disappear randomly. Like, we didn't hear anything. Transforming abilities. Yeah, it didn't yeah. transform into anything. It just, like, vanished. I, I, yeah. There's no way to explain it. Yeah, that is weird. Mission Update 1. It's all ripped. The retrieval operation commences at full 400 hours with MTF Epsilon 6 to sexually locating and securing a species 323 with no initial resistance. Observations post retrieval indicate that SBC 323 exhibits a docile state during periods of inactivity, suggesting that the active mm -hmm. containment measures may be reduced during transport. However, continuous monitoring is imperative to preempt any unforeseen activation of its anomalous properties yeah. dude this is crazy what are we, what are we reading Seriously. right now this is crazy the transport route for the retrieval site to facility alpha 9 has been mapped to avoid populated areas and potential foundation exposure security checkpoints have been established at key intervals to ensure the uninterrupted passage and integrity of the containment unit so they're trying to keep this like really like under wraps. They don't want anyone knowing what's going yeah. on here. Mission update two, it's kind of just been ripped off. Hmm. Guys, if we're skipping over like a lot of this, you could easily just like pause the video and read this all for yourself. I'm sure there's like a bunch of stuff, but I don't know if we have like the time to like get through all of this. Oh that shit. One's all like blacked out. In case of containment breach, in the event of a containment breach, the following protocols have been developed to reestablish containment of SCP-323. Option one is employ something, ensure something, 
are administered via remote activation if direct personal contact is impossible. I don't really know what, what that would entail. Option two is lure SCP-3231 to enclosed location and maintain quarantine until fasting state reestablishes. Utilizing blank in the immediate area, see experiment records trial six, and then see incident report 802-K. And then the last one is option three, which is circled. Lure SCP-3231 to remote unpopulated location. Restrict any potential blank in designated area for a minimum of blank until fasting state observed. Maintain continuous remote surveillance using blank. Huh. Early mutation stage, elevated sensory functions, SCP-3231 exhibits superior tracking abilities, likely oh attributed to enhanced in something, suggesting a significant augmentation of its sensory capabilities. Yo, that's Dude. creepy. And if it was anything like that thing that was outside following us for God knows how long? Yeah, if, yeah. if that's, that's what this is talking about. Like, I, re I remember it, like, following us for a very long time. Yeah. And we were, like, cutting into the woods, trying to get through all the snow. And it was just, like, literally nonstop. It wasn't sprinting. It was literally just, like, falling. What us. if it's smart enough to, like, stop showing us that it's following us? You know what I mean? And, like, Dude. what if it's nearby? Like, what if it's literally outside right now? It has enhanced endurance. The engineer has shown resilience well beyond typical human threshold for physical damage and exhaustion, indicating a profound alteration to its psychological makeup. Well, I don't remember anything. Definitely didn't read any of that. Nope. Let's put that in there and leave it, uh, leave it be. Boom. Whoa. What? what is that? Like driver's license? Yeah. We got two of them. Why are they burnt? I don't know. Restricted access personal records. Code name, designation unknown. Mm -hmm. This might be the soldiers that we were talking to. Oh, really? Or like oh. the one that was like attacked. Well, why are they Confidential out? personal records restricted. And this might be like their IDs. Field assignment SCP-323 retrieval mission. This guy might be the guy that we saw in the woods. Yeah, wait, there's there's two files, which means there's two people. Wait, there's two people. Yeah, the other soldier mentioned the other guy ran away from the bear. Hmm. So that you might be this guy or this guy. He's alive still? What if it was that guy on the freaking walkie-talkie? That is true, but he, he seemed very calm. Yeah, he seemed like he would have known, you know? He seemed like he doesn't really know. What, he didn't know that the, the skull was missing. He didn't know about the bear attack either, so no. Yeah. That's true, yeah. yeah. Well, the other guy wouldn't have known about the skull missing because he's gone. We didn't even see him. We didn't even know he was in, you know, around. Guys, if you want to read through this, send us some comments if there's anything that we're missing. But I don't know if uh, we're going to get too nitty gritty into the details. It just looks like they're personal files, you know. And that's it? That's in here? Like, there's no... Yeah, there's just this. <laughs> nice. Oh. Dude, what? It's a USB. What is that doing there? Bro, I don't know. How the hell? What, why is it like hidden? Wait, we have a laptop. We should put it in. You think it's gonna work? I mean, maybe. Well, let's see. What could we possibly find in here? Yo, what, what the hell? Holy oh, shit! Oh my god, yo, what are we? What the hell? Who's that? Hello? Hello? Hey, hey, hey! Who the hell are you? Sorry. Who are you? Hi. Uh, where, 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 we just found this cabin. We're, yeah, we're, we're lost. We're lost. Yeah, we're lost. We were just looking around and we came across this warm cabin. Is there anybody else here? Nobody. No, just just us. What the hell were you guys doing here? We 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 were we were in the woods and then we stumbled upon someone who, yeah. who was dressed like just like you. Yeah. What? Um, but he he was injured and then we tried to get medicine for him and then. Like, he just like disappeared, and then we saw this thing. Like, th there's it's, so much going on. There's so much. What is going hey, on? Hey, slow down. <clears throat> you saw someone like me? Yeah. Yeah, just like Almost you. Almost the same actual setup. He had a veil over his face. Oh. Or... Where is he? What? Uh, Where is he? Uh, Did he have it with him? Something happened to him. Yeah, something happened. What? What happened? Where's the skull? He just disappeared. He's telling the, the, the skull. The skull disappeared, and we tried to help him out. We left him for like two seconds, and then he he just disappeared. 
There was a pool of blood, yeah. and the skull was gone. And was there was gone some sort of attack, and there was a thing, and, and yes, I don't know. The Wendigo. Yeah. That's the only way I could describe it. There was a Wendigo standing in the woods, what? What and your friend like? was just gone. Pool of blood. Yep. Yep. So you don't have the skull? You don't have the skull? No, we don't have we, the skull. We, we, we lost it. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Wait. Move, 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 Jesus. Okay. At least we have this. Where is it? Where is it? Key card. Where is the key card? Key card. What key card? The, uh, there was, what, what, what did it look like? Rectangle. Small rectangle. Yeah, there was. Oh, yeah. Bad. Where is it? Um, Please tell me you have it. You're not going to like this, but there was one on the other guy. <laughs> what do we need that key card? What's so what's so special about yeah, it? Yeah, like, what's, what's going on? We can't on? just like leave him out there. Like we can't share them, but we need it. Well, maybe if you told us, we could maybe help you. Or like, I don't know. Thank you. You said it was on a, the other soldier. Yeah, it was yeah, on it his was, like it was on his lap. like lap on his side. Yeah, but he disappeared. He well, disappeared, and then the Wendigo showed up. Oh, yeah, yeah. God damn it! We need to find it. Hunt that thing. Wait, 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 wait. dude. SCP three two three one. It really like, takes over the host. Maybe that's what you're thinking about. Okay. Um. What is it? We're thinking. Uh, is there any way that that Wendigo that we saw was your friend? Just tell uh, us. It's possible. It's highly likely. Okay. He may have transformed. If that's is true, then the key card is on the Wendigo, and you're saying that we need it back. Yes. I don't know how we're gonna do it. We have to. We have to find a way. That thing is dangerous. It needs to consume flesh. And if it finds nothing else in the area, it'll go farther. If that thing reaches civilization, people will die. We need to stop it. Shit. Crap. That's not good. That is really, really bad. Okay, well, um, um... So, if it keeps eating, what happens if we prevent it from eating? That is its only weakness. And it needs to constantly eat. So if it doesn't eat... It's weak. It dies. Okay. Okay. Well, what are you thinking? I don't, I don't know. I feel like I'm not the pro at this. We need a, some some kind of solution to stop it from eating, right? So, yeah. like, can we trap it? Would that work? Yeah, we can. We could trap it. I know exactly how. All right. Um. Okay. Yep. We're doing this. Right <laughs> We're now. doing this. Apparently, um, looking yeah. mighty fine, man. A little risky, but uh, I so, guess that works. If you guys want to check that out, nice piece of this meat. this in the fridge. <laughs> oh my rotten, God! Man. <laughs> oh God! Yeah. And this is our bait. Yeah. Um, don't ask me how I got in the situation. Apparently, this is the best way to do it. So, the idea is. If it's following me, it's following me because of the smell. And then once we're inside, we can lure it into a room and then trap it. Yep. Should work. Full proof. All right. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know if we want to like, we're pretty close to the cabin. I don't know if we want yeah. to go like super deep in the woods and then like lose ourselves again. Yeah. Well, we'll just can, you know, continue down the trail and I'm sure eventually we'll get some sort of sign that it's nearby. Right. If it is. What was that? Yeah, why not? Be loud. We want them to come, right? <laughs> Only one way to do it. Woo! Ow! Woo! I don't know. I don't like it. We're getting a little close. Yo. Wait. Yo. I think that's him. Somebody's moving over there. Hello? Hey, is that Back up. someone there? Someone there? Looks like a person. Dude, it looks like a person. I can't tell if it's it. You know what the right is. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. 
Michelle, it's coming closer. It's getting really close. Oh my God. Close. You see that? Yo, that's it. That's, that's it. literally it. Oh, hey! Hey! Over here! Yeah. We got some meat for you. Yeah, just, just keep following us. Come on. Yeah. Holy f Dude, that's you sure this is a good idea, man? It's not too late to back out. Uh, we're, we're really close. I just trust that soldier guy. Come on! Yeah, you know you want it. I know you can smell it. It's right here. Oh, what the fuck? Yo, he's getting close. Yo, yo, yo. yo. yo we gotta, Michelle? We gotta go. He's, he's getting close. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Okay, just keep going. Let's get inside. Crap. Oh, crap. Come on. Oh, just go, just go. Oh, yeah, he's coming. Alright, alright. Get ready. Come on, come on. What the hell? I think he knows. He's panicking. Dude. Yo. What? Yo. What is he pulling out? He's pulling the freaking cord. What? Take it off me. Take it off me, boat. Take it off. It's like super early. Oh. Right? Okay. You guys remember the plan, right? This is part of it. Let's go. Okay, okay. Dude. Jesus. You think it's still on down there? I hope not. Did you hear the sounds it was making? Dude, right? it was crazy. Come on! Okay, here okay, we're coming. Okay. Okay. Oh, man. Well, it looks like he's still injured. Here. What? Get here. What? With what? And you bring the skull. You have to. 
Why? Dude, no. did you not just see what the hell just happened? We just did all of this, like what? Yeah, I saw it. And if you don't get this skull, get this location, it'll be way worse. The thing, man, the thing of the world is at stake. I would do it, but I, I can't. My injuries. <coughs> what the hell, man? He wants us to go all the way up there? How far of a hike is that? That looks like it's cr That's where we are right now? It'll be a hard journey, but you have to. You have to bring this skull. And what's more, this. You cannot forget this. It's the only way you'll get in and out of that facility. Okay. Alright, I guess I'm like force. Are we doing this? It's important. I think so. Okay, so what you're saying is if we use this, we could get in to whatever facility this is. Okay. And as long as we bring the skull there, that's all we have to do? All we have to do.